Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today guys, we're gonna be doing my hair. I'm gonna be curling my hair. I'm about to go out um, for a few drinks with some of my friends, just something very casual. We'll probably just go get something to eat, get some tacos and go out, very casual. So anywho you guys, today I am rocking my Unice hair, Eunice or Unice hair. I already been wearing this hair, you guys. I've been wearing this hair before New Year's. I actually will insert some pictures of me rocking this hair, but I've been wearing this hair. I already have it glued on my head. I do have to fix it a little bit because I've had this on for um, about three or four days now. So I have to touch up the baby hairs and also just touch up the lace because it's like, loose a little bit so first i'm going to curl my hair and i'm going to answer some questions that you guys asked me on instagram i asked you guys to ask me some questions and of course we have our wine tonight <sighs> all right so yes you guys i'm about to curl my hair and i'm going to answer these questions because of course you guys don't want to sit here and watch me try to curl my hair i'm gonna ask some questions i wrote them down all from instagram you guys want to know what's going on so i don't know if you guys noticed but i did move so i'm in a whole different setup i'm in my new beauty room <laughs> um i am so grateful and i am so happy for my new place it is beautiful i am in love with it um yeah so I'm trying to get the lights back how I had it because I had my lights so perfect in the old apartment. But I think, I think I got it. So, first I'm going to split this hair up into parts. This is how I curl my hair when it's like this. I actually need to wash this hair because I haven't washed it since I installed it. So, it needs to be washed because it feels a little heavy. But we're not going to do that today. It's going to still look cute. I'm going to do my edges at the end after I get done with curling. Okay, so I'm going to just comb it out. This is a body wave hair. And this is like, this is not like the natural curls on it. I did braid it last night. You can wear it like a wavy look if you want to. But I'm just going to put very soft curls. I don't like perfect curls. I don't know how to do perfect curls, but I don't like perfect curls either. Um, I like them just to look a little fluffy, and that's it. And I'll leave the link to this hair down in the description box. Like I said, this is Eunice hair. So, just gonna use my flat irons today. I don't really know how to use a curling iron on my hair, so I usually just use my flat, iron, flat irons. And I just flip it going backwards. I can't really see in this room. I can see. See, that's a good curl. That's a good enough curl for me. I tell y'all, I don't really know how to curl my hair, girl. I know how to beat my face. I know how to dress a little bit, but when it comes to curling my hair, I be struggling. But I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. If I know how to put on lashes, I should know how to curl my hair, right? <laughs> so, okay, let's answer these questions, y'all. Let's get to it. Cause I don't want this video to be super long. Okay. What is the name of the glow spray that you spray on your body? Um, I told you guys, I don't like lotion, so I use the Neutrogena Wet Skin um, Spray, this right here. <laughs> this is what I use to spray all over my body. I love the shine it gives me. It just makes my skin look really, really soft and glowy, and I really like that, okay? How old is your son? My son is about to be nine. Wow, Joseph is about to be nine. That's good. He's about to be nine in February. He's an Aquarius like me, like his mommy. We act just alike. <laughs> what color theme for your new home? What is your color theme for your new home? Um, my color theme for my new home is nudes, like a like brown, like tan. Uh, white, nudes, blacks. Yeah, those are my scheme. Like nude, whites, blacks, and browns. So very neutral colors. Very much so neutral color. My pop of color will be black for sure. Okay, 
So yeah, if you guys don't know, I have, um, I'm doing the RH theme. If you ever seen RH Restoration Hardware on Instagram, you guys can hashtag it. You'll see it's like a very sultry, grown and sexy, simple type of look. That's what I'm going for. I'll probably insert a picture of um, what I'm going for for my new apartment. Somebody said, how do you deal with stress as a mom, a wife, and look so damn good, girl? I don't always feel good. I be looking like a bomb. Oh my gosh. Sometimes I have to be like, now Bree, you gotta get it together. But um, I don't look like a bomb for too long though. Cause I just, when I look good, I feel good. Um, When I look good, I feel good for sure. But I get stressed out, girl. I get stressed out all the time. Like all the time. I'm just like anybody else. I get stressed out. I get anxiety. I get overwhelmed. I cry. I break down. Like I don't have it all together. I mean, I don't let myself stay like that for too long. I do kind of try to do stuff to make me be in a better spirit, but I definitely stress out. And as far as looking good, thank you so much for thinking I look good. Because there's some days I'll be like, girl, I haven't worked out in a minute and I need to get in the gym like ASAP. Tomorrow I'm working out. The rest of the week I'm working out. But I still feel good. And I, you know, I just, I love peppering myself. And, but I still be stressed. Okay, I might be at the nail salon stress the hell out, but I'm going to be at the nail salon because I need my nails done. I can't walk around looking like a bum. <laughs> but yeah, when you look good, you feel good. The next question is, say, do you exercise because you keep them curves together? Girl, no, I don't exercise. I need to exercise more so I can get back tight because I don't mind being a little chubby. Okay, I don't like, I don't mind being a little, a little thick, but baby, I like to be tight. Okay, I like my body, my legs my thighs to be tight and toned. I'm not really big on like the scale because I'm naturally just big bounded. Like I'm a thick girl and I don't think, I don't think I'll ever get to be super, super lean. I don't, I just don't think that's in my bones. I always had this round face and stuff like that. But to answer your question, I don't exercise. I use good shape wear. And girl, that shape where I help those curves, period. <laughs> so yeah, and that's I hope hopefully that answered your question. Okay, somebody said, do you have any advice on leveling level leveling up? Um, this question is so like. I always feel like this question is so hard because everybody have their own way of le le leveling. Why well, can't I say that? Leveling up. Um, it all depends on what you consider leveling up is. Like, I don't know. Some people might feel like leveling up is like making more money, getting a different position at work, owning your own business. So, the way I look at leveling up is like living my dream life in my um, head. If I can visualize it, I need to touch it, period. Um, I manifest a lot of things in my life now. I just really got into manifesting about two years ago. And when I tell you it works, it works. I meditate <laughs> and I also manifest. Um, maybe I'll do a video on that. It's really personal, but um, if you guys want to know, like, some of the things that I do to help me manifest something, but um, to answer your question, how you level up, you just gotta, you know, you, 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 you gotta just try to be the best you can be, shoot. Like, just a better you. This year, 2021, I want to be a better version of 2020, Brie, you know? So, okay, the next question is, do you want more babies? I don't know why y'all always ask me about babies, girl. <laughs> I'm <laughs> like, there's more to life than just having babies all day. I don't, I don't, I love 
babies and I love my baby, but I don't just want to have babies like that, okay? I'm just not that girl. <laughs> I mean, you know, I'm just not her. But <laughs> do I want more babies? Um, eventually I do want one more, one more baby, but, um, whenever that happens, people are always talking about babies. What if, although I'm not trying, but what if I was trying and I was really struggling with getting pregnant and you guys always ask that question. I just feel like it's kind of like, I get where you coming from, but what if people struggle with getting pregnant and people are like, oh, when you gonna have another baby? When you gonna have another baby? When you gonna have another baby? <sighs> you know? But I don't struggle with having a baby. I think I'm pretty fertile. Um, I think. I haven't tried in a long time. But um, eventually I will have me another baby. And I hope y'all um, help me take care of this baby. Because y'all want me to have these babies so bad. I hope y'all send me some cash apps and help me take care of this baby because baby and that goes for my family my friends everybody because I get this question all day about baby 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 <laughs> oh my gosh I understand though I understand I understand I understand y'all just want to see me have a little girl huh one day, y'all. One day. Last question is, how are you liking your new place? No, this is not the last. Why well, I keep saying the last question? Um, I am loving my new place. Everything about it is so... This place is just sexy. The layout, it's just sexy. I love this place. Um, you guys, this hair curls. One thing I like about Eunice's hair is that the hair is so fluffy. I haven't washed this hair in about two weeks, probably almost three weeks. And look how fluffy this hair is. Like, it's so fluffy and so pretty. This is all the curls I know how to do, y'all. I suck at curling. So this is what my curling consists of. So I'm going to go ahead and lay this lace back down a little bit because I can't be caught like that. So um, yeah, the next question is, how are you able to remain classy and feminine? Any tips? I'm gonna do a whole video on my feminine journey, you guys. I get a lot of questions on me being feminine. Um, I do feel like I am a feminine girl. Like I am really into my girly girl self. <laughs> So I'll definitely, but I wasn't always like that. Um, so I definitely want to do a video on the things that I do to make me feel more feminine. Um, I do feel like I am a feminine um, lady. I'm very ladylike, but I like I like those type of girls. I follow a lot of feminine girls on Instagram that I feel that is very feminine, and um, I just feel like we can relate on so many levels. I don't follow a lot of masculine type of girls like um for example not that I don't like them or I don't think they're pretty I just don't feel like we can relate on different levels like Megan Thee Stallion she's just so rough around the edges she's beautiful but she's just not my type of girl that I will follow and get inspiration from because she's just so hard and I'm I like more like soft Jeanne Aiko type of girls or like um who's another like soft airy type of girl I like those type of women I like every type of woman but I like to follow and get my inspiration for from those type of women like a type like a very neo so just very soft ladies soft spoken and just like flowers and you know like our wine we don't really do Hennessy on the rocks you know no offense because I know a lot of my friends do that and I think they are crazy but you know I just like to follow girls who inspire me like um there's so many other women I don't even know their name but I'm gonna definitely do a um 
a video on that. I think that'll be a great topic to talk about. I don't feel like I'm as feminine as it comes. Like, I feel like I can get more. I'm still, you know, I'm still on this journey of my, I'm still on this journey to being like the most feminine type of woman that I can be. But it takes time, honey. It takes time. Cause sometimes people be making me want to come out of my character. But I be like, you know what, Brie? It's not worth it. It's not worth it, girl. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'll definitely do a video on that, sweetie. I don't know about you guys, but my favorite app is Pinterest. I I don't know. I do like different mood boards on Pinterest when it comes to like how to be more feminine or even home decor, even leveling up my life. I kind of save stuff on Pinterest and I'm like, you know what? I'm going to make this come alive. Like I'm going to do this. I'm going to take a picture just like this. I'm going to um, drink this type of wine. Like I learned so much from Pinterest. Oh my gosh. I love Pinterest. Everything about Pinterest I love. So I'm just using my Boho Active Glue and I just put a little bit on the side just to push those baby edges down. I'm not even gonna do my baby edges over because it's not that deep. I just wanted to come and show you guys this beautiful, beautiful hair from Eunice. We're gonna add a little layers in this hair up in this area. I didn't layer this hair a lot, but I should've. So, it don't look so like straight right here. Oh yes, that is better. See, when you layer your hair, you don't have to curl it so much cause it's like, It looks curled more. So yeah, I like that. Yeah, that is really cute. I'm gonna keep practice. 2021, I'm gonna get this curling thing down pat. I promise y'all. Cause y'all be curling y'all hair with no problem. And I'm like, well, why don't my curls come out like that? But that's okay. I'ma learn. Oh, this is pretty. This is pretty. I probably can put a little bit more waves, I mean more layers up in this area. Okay, see? That makes it look even fluffier. Ugh. You, you know, you gotta have your hair when your hair got body. Your hair gotta move, girl. It's something about that jet black hair that moves like, hey, you talking to me? Hey, how are you? You talking to me? <laughs> yes, black, jet black hair with soft curly curls. This is really cute. So you guys, this is the hair I layered. You guys check out Eunice Wigs. I'm not going to keep you any much longer. I love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.